Why is there a scarcity of male nudity in media imagery, but an abundance of unclothed females? There is a strong stigma against male nakedness. Nobody wants to see it, so it doesn't appear very much. When it does show up, people think it's excessive. They think it's gratuitous. Thus, shots that include full frontal male nudity can often be timed on a stopwatch, but scenes that feature women naked require a sundial. Although the movie industry is no longer exclusively dominated by men, the United States has historically been a patriarchic society. Men were the only ones running things. They controlled images, be it cinematography, painting, television, sculpture, or theater, and men created media for an all-male audience. Men would rather look at women naked than men naked, so naked women appeared more. Even though marketing agents now definitely do consider their female audiences, the legacy of this male-dominated media platform is still deeply ingrained in our conscious mind. Thus, nudity in films is reserved for women. Okay, so male nakedness is much less prevalent than female, but that still doesn't quite explain why exactly Americans cringe at the sight of male genitalia. Perhaps it's due to the liquid homophobia that permeates the American psyche. Unfortunately, most people are scared by homosexuality. Coupled with this fear comes the tendency to distance oneself from homosexuals. In doing so, one is reaffirming his role as a heterosexual in a heteronormative culture. Establishing oneself in this role can be overt as calling two men holding hands a nasty slur, or subtle as being disgusted by the sight of a penis to verify one's identity as a heterosexual. But it's not just men who are grossed out by male genitalia. It makes women uncomfortable too. Granted that women are also influenced by the values of a traditionally male-dominated culture, I don't think this is the only reason women don't like to look at the Johnson. It could very well be that women are not as sexually charged as men. Boys Gone Wild videos have never been as popular as the DVDs that feature teenage girls exposing their privates to video cameras. But females are not grossed out by seeing their fellow women naked. Sigmund Freud theorized that all women have homosexual tendencies. Although I think that many of Freud's theories are far-fetched, this hypothesis is scientifically proven in an investigation conducted by Dr. Shivers on behalf of the Center for Addiction and Mental Health in a very in a study where various photographs were shown to women while their heart rate was being recorded. The results prove that straight women are in fact stimulated by seeing other women naked, and in many case, cases, even more so than pictures of men. I'm not trying to suggest that it's wrong for women to have lesbian tendencies, but I do think heterose heterosexual women not being aroused by men is a problem. I don't think that female homosexuality or male homophobia is scientifically inherent either. Rather, I think that these inclinations are perpetuated by the lack of male nudity in media. The less men appear naked, the more homophobia will be accepted, the more our heteronormative culture will be reaffirmed, the more men will be grossed out by seeing male genitalia, and the less women will be aroused by men's bodies. So. I propose a solution. Expose male nudity, for that is the only way we can ever hope to move past our biases. For Youth Radio, I'm Ben Feldman. To hear this commentary and more, please visit our website at www.youthradio.org.